Hi, I'm Barry Sahajan, and today I'm going to cover bass rhythms for blues progressions and blues lines. What you just heard in the introduction is one of the lines I'm going to use, number one, and let me explain what's going on there and what I'm going to do with all of these lines. I have four lines, and the challenge of playing repetitive blues lines, you have to keep the main motif intact. The only way to make, move around and make it more interesting is to add different rhythms. You can't go so far that you lose the identity of the line. You've still got to hear that all the time. What you do, you make small variations as you go through the line so the listener is always hearing something different and it gets their attention and keeps their attention. That's what I'm going to do today. I want to show you how to do that. Let me first explain what I did in the first line, then we'll move on. So, It's a dominant seventh chord, a G dominant seventh chord, and I'm using the arpeggiated notes plus one extra note, the sixth. And that happens commonly in the blues. If you've learned your boogie progression, you know that there's the sixth right there. So it's one, three, five, six, flat seven, six, five, three, one, boogie. So in this line, I'm maintaining that sixth in there, but I'm adding the rhythm. I also am adding a double chromatic approach from the flat seven, which is nice. On a line like this, you can do all kinds of things without actually changing it as well. Like articulation. I was putting in short notes here and there. It's always moving. It's alive. And that's what makes it sound nice. And then you add a little musicality to it and you've got it. In this next example, I'd like to illustrate how making very small changes to your line can make a big difference. I will play it, and you might notice it almost sounds the same as the line I just played, 3A. This would be 3B. Instead of playing the F twice on the second measure, third beat, I put a rest in where the first F was, and that's what made the difference. That's number 3A. Now we play 3B. Instead of 